Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if Google Chrome is not being responsive and it's really acting slow on your computer. So the first thing I'd actually recommend doing is trying to uninstall the web browser and then reinstall it. However, if that's not possible in your case, which actually I believe would work and fix a lot of your guys' issues, if that would not work, then we're going to go through another method in this tutorial that should hopefully be able to resolve that. So we're going to jump right into it and we're going to start by opening up the start menu. And you want to type in Chrome. Best match should say Google Chrome. You want to right click on it and then left click on open file location. The shortcut that should be highlighted after you click on the link should say Google Chrome right here. You want to right click on it and then left click on properties from the bottom of this context menu. Now in the target field right here, you want to go all the way over where it says Chrome.exe in the end quotation mark. You want to do a space. So again, you want to have a space in here. I know it's kind of hard to tell, but in between this quotation mark and the blinking cursor, there is a space in here. And you want to type in minus sign, no, minus sign, sandbox. So again, space, minus sign, no, minus sign, sandbox. Minus sign, subtraction sign, whatever you want to refer to it as. And you want to click on apply down here you're going to have to provide administrator permission. Click continue right here, then click on OK. Now I'd recommend closing out of this window. If you have any shortcuts on your taskbar, I'd recommend right clicking on them and then unpin from taskbar. And then go back in the star menu and type in Chrome. Right click on the best match and then just pin to taskbar. And then if you try to open up Google Chrome, it should work fine. So I do hope this brief video was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.